So as hurricanes batter several American states, the upcoming presidential election is kicking up a storm of its own. Now, Kamala Harris has slammed her political rival Donald Trump for putting politics over people with respect to national disasters. On Tuesday, the Democrat presidential nominee accused her Republican rival of not having any empathy or sympathy for the people. Now, Harris's accusation came in the backdrop of Donald Trump reportedly spreading misinformation about the government's response to Hurricane Helene. As agencies are grappling with the disaster relief and mitigation, Donald Trump has repeatedly said that the White House under Joe Biden is diverting disaster relief funds to unrelated migrant programs. In response to this accusation, the Federal Emergency Management Agency, or FEMA, has issued a statement on its official website, fact-checking Donald Trump's claims. The FEMA statement says that the rumors about disaster funds being diverted is completely false and that no money meant for the flood-affected victims has been diverted. Now, the Red Camp's presidential nominee has also repeatedly criticized the Biden administration's response to Hurricane Helene. He's in fact gone as far as saying that the president wasn't picking up calls and there is an anti-Republican bias in how Joe Biden and Kamala Harris are responding to the crisis. But this isn't the only thing that Donald Trump has made false or unsubstantiated statements on this week. Now, in a radio interview, the former American president claimed that he had visited the Gaza Strip while answering a question on the region. However, there is no evidence whatsoever of Donald Trump having visited the war-torn enclave. It could be better than Monaco. It has the best location in the Middle East, that best water, the best everything. It's got, it is the best. I've said it for years. I, you know, when I've, I've been there and it's rough, it's a rough place before the, you know, before all of the attacks and before okay. back and forth, what's happened over the last couple of years. With less than a month to go for the elections in the country, several states are already conducting mail voting and early ballots as well in the run-up to the 5th of November elections. The Democrat candidate Kamala Harris and her Republican opponent Donald Trump are stuck in a complete polling loop where both candidates are being cited for victory across various surveys. Now, a recent poll shows that a majority of the black registered voters support Kamala Harris. The poll conducted in the middle of September found that 7 in 10 black members have favorable opinion of Kamala Harris, with a few differences between black men and women voters on how they view the Democrat candidate. Now, the black voters' opinion of Donald Trump, by contrast, appears to be overwhelmingly negative, underscoring the challenge that the Republican candidate faces as he's seeking to erode Kamala Harris's support. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.